Hey guys, and welcome back to day 17 of Ethany's 31 Days of Tarot 2019. Today's prompt is, what is your favorite way to tarot journal? Planners, apps, bullet journals? And this prompt is brought to us by Jen Sankey. So I have another video on bullet journaling and tarot journaling and I will link that if you're interested in a little more detail, but what I'm, what I'm about to tell you is pretty much um, a, a quick recap of, of that video, which is that for tarot journaling, when I'm uh, reflecting on a personal reading or a personal daily draw, I usually like to use my Google Notes app because it's online and it's password protected and it's private and I am for some reason like paranoid about people reading my most private thoughts even though I completely trust my it's only my husband and me you know my cats can't read it but I don't know it's just like I don't know why but I for some reason am paranoid about that like I'm just very private about that so yes that is that goes online and then for I mean, this is not necessarily journaling, but it's just random tarot note taking. I will use just a, a Mead notebook like this. Nothing fancy. I'm not trying to be at all organized. I, um, I don't have anything in any particular category. I paste things in there. Um, yeah, so, so this is just a basically a brain dump of anything that I am learning or want to remember and take particular note of for tarot or Lenormand or Oracle even, but this is predominantly tarot. And then I do have a bullet journal, my Bujo, and this is a catch-all for me. I use it as a planner, scrap book for scrapbooking, for a little bit of journaling. Uh, but in terms of tarot, there's not as much tarot because as I've said, I like to keep my tarot reflections and journaling more on the private side, but there's like a little bit that I do tarot related in my bullet journal. I like to photocopy certain cards that I want to be reminded of throughout the week or the month or the year. So for instance, one of my latest pages is for my depth here, beginning of depth here. So I decided to make note of my word of the year and my card of the year, and this is just a photocopy from Everyday Tarot, and my card of the year is the Judgment card. So that's one way I like to keep tarot documented, and I'll do that, I've done that throughout this, this bullet journal. So another example, I think I showed this in my other video too, so my stalker card, Eight of Pentacles, I wrote a little bit of a note on that, and also you can see here that I do record my daily draw in symbols that only I can understand. So anybody looking at this, anyone else wouldn't understand what those symbols mean, but I can. And it's nice to have that daily record in my bullet journal as well. So that is it for this prompt. Thank you to Jen. And I will see you for day 18.